The default view mode is value added, non value added. However, there will be times when you want to do some ergonomic analysis. For instance, over here, this stockman is loading this cage up, and you might have some concerns about the way he's doing it. If you watch the video, obviously, he could hurt himself doing that. He probably needs some help there. And he could also potentially damage the product dropping it down onto the uh, trolley like that. So, what can we do here? So, what we're going to do is click on the ergonomics mode here and the colors will change here and then what we do is we double click on the load cage and it will bring up the body map and now we can play back here the video and pause it and we see something of concern so right here you might be looking at this uh, and saying well he's going to hurt his back so you can click on the lower back here these are the different stresses you can have no stress, light, moderate or severe I'm going to say that's going to be pretty severe stress on the back here he's reaching with his right arm so we'll give a moderate stress on the arm and the hand here. And since we get the video, you can also notice he's standing in one foot as well. You might miss that if you're just watching manually. So these are the different stresses, and then we can identify the types of stresses. Obviously lifting, force, posture definitely, twisting and turning, but not repetition, eye strain, temperature, environment. So what we're going to do here is say that it's about 70% of the total video. We'll put a note in here, say he needs help and could damage product. Okay, From here we can also just click the print button here and that will actually send this information out to Excel so we could have it here and we could uh, perhaps uh, email it over to the supervisor in that department and if the supervisor gets it, of course he can click on the link and play the video directly from here. So this is our uh, analysis here for the ergonomic situation and when we save that here it's going to highlight that particular activity as being something that we need to look at a little closer from an ergonomics point of view. And obviously we can do that for any of the activities we see on the process here. And here's an example actually of a full process showing the different ergonomic stresses. And obviously the, the grey area means there's no stress, uh, the green is light, yellow is moderate and the red is dangerous. So if you wanted to see what is happening here you can just double click on this and it's going to bring it back up and then we can play the video here. And we can see here that the issue is that the operator is having to bend down so we probably want to raise the machine up a little bit so he didn't have to bend down all day to work with this. So this is an example of how you can use the ergonomic color coding to highlight the different stresses you may have in your process.